Happy Holidays, Merry Christmas, Frohe Weihnachten, Feliz Navidad, Gazoa Krishlinjet, Joya Noel, Buon Natale, Gratschun Verici. And since we're in the mood, we are going to be doing a holiday makeup look. It's be simple, fun, easy, um, the best way that I know how to show you guys. I don't know what else to tell you, but you know, just keep it simple. We are going to start with a makeup primer. I always use the No Pore Blim Primer in by Touch and Soul. I'm just gonna take a little bit, one pump, and we are going to put it in to the pores. And if you guys see up here, I burnt myself earlier. It hurts so bad. I think it turned purple, bluish purple. Once our primer's on, I'm gonna go in with any foundation you guys have, you can use. But I'm gonna go in with the ColourPop No Filter Foundation and I'm just gonna put one pump on the back of my hand and take my little trusty dusty sponge. Dusty it is, huh? And I'm just gonna work it into my skin. I am going to try to cover up my little burn mark that I did earlier. It is time for concealer. I'm going to go in with my ColourPop No Filter Concealer in the color Dark 40. Before I go in with my banana powder to bake, I'm gonna go in with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Espresso. Need to buy some more of this. And we're gonna go in and contour. I just realized that I didn't even do my eyebrows yet. It's my least favorite thing to do, eyebrows. To me, it's easier to contour first, so then when you go back in with your baking powder, um, if you put too much concealer, you can, wait, too much contour, you can just kind of like blend it in and cover it up with your um, baking powder. Now that I'm all contoured, I'm gonna go in with my banana baking powder. First of all, I'm going to bake my eyebrows because I always do that before I do them because um, my skin is so oily and makes them last longer. So I just take a whole bunch, just slap it on there. Mm. I'm going to go in under my eyes because the eyeshadow that I'm going to be using, it has some glitter in it and I get very messy when it comes to glitter. So I'm going to make sure if I do have some fallout, it's not going to be all over the map and then I can't get it off my skin. I'm just gonna go in, clean my eyebrows off. I think I'm gonna go in with the Kat Von D Brow Struck and this is in the color Dark Brown. What I like to do when I use this product is take a little brush like so and dip it in some setting spray. Just kind of dampen it a little bit. Just kind of glide it on there and just chase my eyebrows. A small mirror, I can't see anything. Ooh. And as I said before, just like in my other videos, I like a messy brow, I like it bushy, I don't like my brows to be precise. So when I do my brows, I don't try too hard, I just kind of go in and just wisp it everywhere. Yay for uneven eyebrows! I'm going back in with my ColourPop No Filter Concealer and I'm literally just going to clean up underneath the eyebrows and I'm not going to do it on top.
Now we're starting with the eyes. I'm gonna go in with this eyeshadow color. It's called All Natural. I'm gonna go in with that first. I'm literally sticking this color in my crease, just packing it on lightly. And I'm also gonna take the color and pat it in on the outside of my eye corner. I think I'm gonna do a small cut crease and I'm gonna go in with the LA Girl, my color concealer in Warm Honey. And I'm gonna do just like the slightest cut crease, just small. No biggie, no biggie. I'm literally just patting in the concealer. And on the sides of where I did my cut crease, just to kind of blend it in, I'm gonna go back in with the color All Natural. And I'm just taking that color on the edges of this cut crease, just kind of blending it in. I did say earlier in the video that I'm gonna go in with a glitter color and I am gonna use oh yeah, this little bad boy right here. It's called Maxed Out. I'm gonna take a, a I don't know what this is called. It's it's a brush, it's flat, whatever. And I'm gonna spray it with some setting spray. And I'm gonna dip my brush into this glittery color. Oh, Look, I'm literally going to pack this on to where I did my cut crease and hopefully this isn't going to be like overwhelming. Oh my God, that's a beautiful color. You guys, I love gold. Gold is so beautiful. Ah, oh, the glitter is on. Oh my God. That's pretty. I did have some fallout, like I said, with the glitter and I knew I was going to get it everywhere and I got it all over here. I don't know what shows on the camera, but that's on my cheeks. Damn it. Oh, I have a glittery cheek. Underneath my eyes, I'm gonna go in with the same color that I did on in my lids or on my lids, I don't know, crease, in my crease called All Natural. I'm going to run it on my bottom lash line very gently. Before I go on any further, the best part, oh my gosh, lashes. Now, I know a lot of you guys, um, you don't wear lashes, which is fine. You know, just go in with a mascara. Just get you a nice dark mascara that's like very luminous, luminous, voluminous, and it makes your lashes longer, thicker, just to complete the look. But me, on the other hand, I actually love wearing lashes, so I think I'm going to try Girl Power just to see how they look. I haven't worn these or anything, so I probably need to size these on my lashes and see how they fit. 
I think they're fine as they are. So I'm gonna go ahead and put some lash glue on and let the lashes sit for just a minute. While I'm waiting for the eyelashes to dry, I'm gonna go in with a little bit of highlighter and I'm gonna place that on the bridge of my nose and on the tip of my nose. And I'm not gonna do it up underneath my eyebrows because I already have glitter for eyeshadow and it's fallen everywhere and I don't wanna glow, so. Well, I do, but not like a glow stick. And I am going to do the sides of my cheekbones, just a little. I am gonna put a little bit of mascara onto my eyelashes before I put these falsies on. All right, let's slap on my falsies. These lashes are very subtle compared to the ones that I normally wear. And I feel like they're perfect for this look because they're not overwhelming especially if you do like a glitter eyeshadow, you know, makeup look, it's perfect, it's just right. The lashes that I am wearing today are from a company called K Glow Glam, and I found them on Instagram. They actually reached out to me and said, hey, you know, I'll give you a discount if you purchase, and then I'll give you a discount code, and da 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 So I will link everything down below so you guys can go and check it out and use my discount code. I think it's just me, so check it out, and these are pretty nice. I am very impressed. These are beautiful and subtle. To finish up my makeup look, I need to slap my lips on, put some color on there. So I'm gonna go in. This is my NYX lip liner, and this is in the color Hot Red. This is my completed makeup holiday look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I did get glitter everywhere. I don't know if the camera can actually even pick it up, but I did, I was messy. But I think it came out beautiful and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, 